Hello everybody, how's it going? Um, coming at you with another episode of Mitten State Beer Reviews. And today on the show we have something that I have had sitting in my fridge for a minute and have been really, really wanting to try. The Ballast Point Sculpin. Um, so, but you'll have to pardon the lack of Michigan beers on this channel so far. The videos I've been doing of them that I just haven't really turned out well and I haven't been too satisfied with them. But this one I'm just, you kind of got to go all in for so we're just going to roll with it. Um, yeah, like I said, this has been in my fridge for a minute, and I've been waiting for the right time, and it's just a awful day outside. So we're going to open this up, see how it's doing, see how this IPA, uh, you know, lives up to the little bit of hype that surrounds it. And, um, yeah, so uh, this is, I believe, I have the Beer Advocate pulled up for this. So this is, yeah, 7% alcohol, um, American IPA, and, yeah. Without further ado, let's get this into the glass because I'm excited. Ooh, okay. A little on the lighter side. Always a good sign. That's nice. That looks good. That, that looks really good. So it's a lighter golden. It's not like a deep amber like some IPAs are. Super tight head. Oh, that looks like a great beer. Wow. God, that looks so nice. A little bit of a chill haze on the glass. Yeah, that, that looks really nice. Wow. Mmm, smells really good. Smells like you're, uh... I wasn't able to... F I, I didn't look at the hops that was in there, but... It smells like actually similar to a Two-Hearted. It it's got that candy aroma to it. That, like, Starburst... Tropical Starburst smell to it. Not just pine. More so, like, that sweet candy. Mmm, wow. Smells great. Cheers. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's great. Mm. Super good. Oh, wow. The piney, fruity, tropical. Mm. Oh, that's so drinkable. Yeah, that's great. Very, very similar to a Two-Hearted, which is interesting. Definitely reminds me a lot of the Two-Hearted Ale. Um, people say that beer is a little bit out of date in terms of, you know, how relevant it is and how the other beers comparing up to it, but this is pretty similar to it. I get that same, um, that same flavor. That candy hop. Yeah, very good beer. Not nothing. It's not blowing me away. Um, kind of had a little bit higher hopes for it, but it's okay. Um, so yeah, just wanted to come at you for a quick review. I'm gonna give this beer two thumbs up. I'm gonna scrap the rating system. It's a good beer. Try it if you like the style. Um, I don't know how old this can is, so maybe. Oh, yep, we got a date. I believe. So this was, let's see the, nope, that's not a date. So I don't know how old this can is. So maybe the hop characteristics faded off a little bit more, but I was expecting there to be a little bit more of a hot punch. This tastes like a very Midwestern IPA, um, which it is not. These guys are from San Diego, I believe. Yes, San Diego, Ballast Point. Um, so yeah, two thumbs up. Um, nothing out of this world, but nothing terrible by any means. If you like the style, go check it out. And, uh, yeah, thank you for tuning in to this shorter episode of uh, Mitten State Beer Reviews. Um, more episodes to come. I have... What do I have in the fridge? I've got the uh, Deschutes Odessin, something like that, stout. I forgot the name. And then I just got uh, Big Lake Brewing Company's um, Dark Star Coffee Stout. So there's going to be two new ones coming at you soon. Um, and yeah, stay tuned. Thank you once again for watching, and uh, I hope you all have a good evening.